Adobas. Hello everyone, today we do have another match. On the left we do have Agro Nightmare and on the right we have Ram Dragon. So seems that Agro Nightmare won the dice roll, so Nightmare will be starting first. Alright. So Dragon checking his hand. Choosing the Mulligan as he sees a Genesis Dragon, which won't be very good against Agro Nightmare. Alright, so seems that both players are ready. Yep. So Nightmare starting the tempo with a Embling Rave, dealing one damage to both players. One of the best starting for Agro Nightmare currently in the meta. So Dragon passing back the turn with no Blazing Breath to act, uh, to play. Meanwhile, Imbling Rev hit phase for 2 and he does play a Vi. Dragon do have a bit of a remover, so Vi Lizard coming in shooting the Imbling Rev for 1. But will that be enough to stop the uh, Aggro Nightmare? So, Aggro Nightmare choosing to evolve Vi. So, Vi on Evolve do summon the bed, which makes one of the stronger cards in Aggro Nightmare for now, uh, in terms of uh, 2 mana Evolve. And on Strike, he does summon the bed as well. So, this card gave Aggro Nightmare so much body in one turn that unless you're playing low cost mass remover, Sometimes it's kind of hard to just clear the field if you're trading one card for one card. Sometimes it might not even be enough. And with that, he dropped the Dulanda. So Dulanda do put a ghost at the back. Um, that card is pretty good as well during the late game, especially when you have Necro Charge 10. Um, he summoned three ghosts at the back. However, it's not often you will go that far. So Fire Lizard trading the Vi. And Dragon choose to play Ilya with not much answers in hand. So right now, bat and bat swing for one. So um, okay, that's a bit of issue. I think um, both player trying to figure out what is the correct life point. Um, guess one of them didn't calculate the Embling Wraith. Seems like it. However, yep, they have uh, actually, actually uh, resolved the issue. And Lulanda pushing down to 10. And oh, oh, okay. Playful Necromancer playing right now. I mean, it is quite good for 4 mana. You do get a 4 4 body, and whatever ghost that comes down can hit face. So in this case, he on only am missing one. Goes. However, that two will be more than sufficient to bring down uh, Dragon down to eight. Uh, Dragon is having a bit of an issue right now. He does, he do draw a Shenlong. However, he need to ramp up to Shenlong turn, and Shenlong do needs to come down on turn uh, with seven mana to play. So Ilya do trade there. However, it doesn't give the Dragon player the ability to play Olivia, which could have helped him by healing up and discarding a card from opponent's hand. But yeah, he's pushing. Everyone is pushing down too fast for Dragon to answer. And swing the bat for one, pushing down to seven. Dolana hitting for three. And okay, swipe, pushing down to one. And if I'm not wrong, I do see a. Oh, that's very very fast. Uh, yep, demonic strike. So that would be good game, guys. And I hope you guys enjoy this video, even though it's very short. But I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.